Hey, it's Sam from CVP, and we're over at Red's Booth at NAB looking at a new Gemini sensor. So the Gemini's new 5K Super 35 sensor that fits into the Epic W body which goes in line with the existing DSMC2 range. So all of the accessories are still the same as well as the user interface and their general features. So the sensor has a 6 micron photo site which is a little larger than previous red sensors meaning it's a little better at uh, gathering light, better in low light and then better in dynamic range because of that. It has two switchable sensor modes. Uh, and this is actually a physical change on the sensor. It's not any changes to metadata. So you have your standard in your low light. Shown on these two cameras here, your standard mode is running at 800 ISO as a recommendation, and 3200 ISO in the low light mode is the recommended starting point. So this sensor is 18mm tall, which is a little larger than previous RED Super 35 sensors. That means it's better for anamorphic lenses, uh, mainly because it's comparable to 4 perf Super 35. So uh, you're getting a little taller frame, which when you're talking about the aspect ratio as well, that means you're getting a little bit more width. So you're getting better field of view. All in all, the Gemini is a great new addition to the sensor lineup at RED. And I think it will make like a perfect B-cam to monstro shoots and also to uh, documentary filmmakers on the A-cam because uh, of its ability in low light and for its dynamic range and frame rate. So there's, there's tons going for this camera and it's a lot of camera for the money. If you want more information or you want to try the camera in person, please feel free to contact demo team at CVP. Cheers. Walk out. <laughs>